But last night we had over 100 students over to our home for dinner. We see them as the leaders uh, and servants of the next generation. I've had the opportunity to study abroad in Ireland um, as a freshman, as a part of the Irish Studies program, as well as serve in Ethiopia with a lighthouse trip. I actually got a chance to go to Indonesia uh, for the month of January. I've been a part of three mission trips right here at Taylor, going to the Dominican Republic, to Bolivia, and then this most recently to Dearborn, Michigan. Um, it's really about engaging the world as a whole and really like looking outside of where we're at now. I'm always being challenged of what does it mean to be a Christian in today's world, in today's society. Taylor doesn't like to segment life and, and keep your spiritual life over in one corner um, and your professional life over in another and pretend that those things are never going to converge. Now, like whatever you're learning needs to be needs to be first and foremost most glorifying to the Lord. We can be in the laboratory doing research right along with those who have graduated from the top you know, colleges in the U.S., but then also say that we're Christians as well. It's been awesome just to have opportunities to, um, to just be challenged, to, to think outside of the box and really think about how my personal ministry and, and my personal goals in life, how they apply to the world as a whole. I've just been challenged by conversations that I've had with friends and with faculty to consider um, topics that will be important later in life and topics that are important now. Um, we would play soccer, but besides coach, just praying before and after practice and stuff like that, like he would invite us into his home on Wednesday nights and we had Bible studies with him as a team. And that was always the focus of what we were doing. Like we would play soccer, but it was for the reason ultimately to glorify the Lord. Following Christ is part of everyday life at Taylor. It's part of being in your classroom and using the Bible as your textbook at times. It's about following his commands and whether that's the command to be in ministry or to be um, to be a businessman, whatever you're doing, following Christ should be should be your reason for everything. I heard much about the, you know, the gospel and Christ in my science classes as I did in the Bible classes. Before we start class, we pray. And that's something that was like, wow, to me. Through Taylor's emphasis on this global engagement, seeing that the Lord wants to wants to use us and can use us all over the world, and because He's already there. So by living in this community, we're learning how to be bold in our faith, and we're learning how to speak the truth uh, to one another, but then also to share that with other people. They force the student body to ask questions and to not just take people's word for you know, but to find out for themselves. And and in that way, um, I'm learning that that not only my faith, but that of my, my friends here as well. We get to own our faith. We get to own our relationship with Christ. I guess the bottom line is that I love Jesus Christ more from having been here because of the experiences that I've had and being a small group that actually cares about whether or not you're growing in your love for Christ and having professors that live their faith out in front of you and that clearly love Jesus and want to see us make that faith our own.